hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel hi to each and every one of you guys for watching what's up guys my name is diana if you're new here and if you're my oldie boogity what's up what's up welcome back to my channel guys so here i'm going to be doing this video this is a requested video for you guys um basically you guys did ask me to do a prepping um and yeah prepping video for you guys this is me doing prepping for a manicure you can also do this for a nail set i also do this for a nail set now if i don't do the nail set i do the manicure either or uh, but i will show you guys and i'm going to tell you guys i mean when i'm going to do the uh when i would add when i would add the nail tips all right guys so basically here what i'm going to be doing is grabbing my cuticle pusher um and this is a if i see that you guys do need this process i will be doing it if you guys, if i feel like you guys don't need it then i won't do it for a manicure i do do it automatically but for a full set if you guys don't need it i won't do it now here what i'm going to be doing is actually cutting just uh, cutting a little bit the nails uh, I do this for better adhering of the nail tip if I do nail sets. For a manicure, it's optional if you guys do want me to clip your nails off or you guys just want me to use a file and file them down and shape them whatever shape you want. Like she doesn't have any nails here guys. So um, I'm cutting her nails down because her nails are super thin. Now her nails are kind of damaged guys because the reason that my daughter does like to pull her nails off she pulls them off and uh, that is a no-no for you guys uh, don't do that guys i really don't recommend you guys doing that i rather you guys go to dollar tree if you guys do have these items in your house use pure acetone cotton balls and foil paper uh, aluminum foil now if you guys don't have this and you guys don't have also a nail file and a cuticle pusher uh, what you could do is go to your local dollar tree general dollar or dollar general or whatever any dollar store and i'll get your items i don't really recommend a target or walmart per se or uh rite aid those are kind of expensive if you guys do have dollar stores try them out because they do have these items for only one dollar um i would recommend dollar tree if you guys do have a dollar tree around you guys so i would recommend dollar tree dollar tree does have the four items that you will need to do a soak off either a soak off or um you can also do the foil paper method which is at grab foil papers little squares of foil paper add pure acetone to a cotton ball wrap your finger up wait for maybe 15 20 minutes and the entire cuticle uh the entire uh not cuticle the entire acrylic will lift up and you're able to push it down with the cuticle with the cuticle with the cuticle pusher yeah um basically that's how you do it if you want to do a soak off just get two glass bowls or any like plastic bowls that you think that won't uh, melt <laughs> super don't get super super thin plastic from dollar tree get, i would rather you get like a glass bowl and add your acetone and just submerge your nails and wait maybe 15 25 minutes for them to remove um that's also a good thing to do but don't take them off guys don't put, don't rip them off my daughter does that a lot and also she if you guys do, do not know um i've talked about this before in my videos when i do nail sets and when i do the super long extra extra long nail sets those are my daughter's nails and this is my daughter here so um she does get her nails super super long and she also gets hurt because uh, she's not i mean she's used to wearing long nails but sometimes you know she does things and it, her nails get super like she damaged her nails like basically they break in half her own nail breaks in half because her nails are super super long she doesn't you know be careful uh so here she did damage her nails and um yeah so i recommend you guys to kind of you know be careful out there you guys do get extra extra long nails because that it's it's so it's so easy for you guys to damage your entire nail with long ass nails and if you're not careful with them uh so yeah i did tell my daughter to kind of have a break this was her third fail i believe so i did soak them off and here we're just doing this little manicure for her she is going to use just clear nail uh, gel and just you know that's it so basically if you guys do have thin, thin nail beds and you guys have really damaged nails i suggest you guys just to add a lot of oil around your nails nails oils cuticle oil avocado oil um coconut oil i love using coconut oil and avocado oil for my cuticles when i have really damaged nails for her i do have like a little mixture guys um for that 
for also knuckles i did do a mixture of um i did get a uh, garlic cloak like garlic cloves i did get those and i chopped them up in really small small pieces i did put in a little small uh container also adding a little bit of vinegar in that little mixture just because that kind of uh it helps you with fungus if you guys do you know prevent from fungus so I do like that little mixture and I do add it on my nails every other day. I do this basically every night. Every other day in the night, I add that to my nails. And then oil every day. I do add oil every day to my nails just for the nail growth, nail, uh, just, you know, to uh, minerals and all that good stuff to, um, you know, apply my nails so they can grow. So that's what I do. So here I did, um, I gave her that so she could use it for her nails while her nails get restored. I use it a lot when I have my nails super damaged, so basically that's that. So here, what I'm doing now, guys, I'm gonna stop, stop chatting so much, but here, basically, what I'm gonna do is buff the nails. I'll take off all the oil because her nails are super thin, so I'm not using my nail drill on her nails. So I'm just gonna do this and remove off the oils, just kind of sanding it down. Now here, Basically what I'll do here after I'm done applying of course with uh, cleaning them off I'm gonna dust them off and then clean them and also wipe them with uh, alcohol So once when I'm once I'm done doing that, I'm basically gonna add the tips if I was to do a, um, a Nail set I would add tips after the cleaning of the alcohol pad But because I'm not doing a nail set and she's having a manicure i am gonna add a base coat the base coat i am using is by chelixi So yeah, basically this is the part when I would usually put the nail tips after this, but we're not gonna do a nail set, we're doing the manicure, so we're adding a base coat. I love, love this base coat, it's really good. It is by Jelixie, guys. If you guys have not don't know where to purchase Jelixie, um, you can also look for it on Amazon. I do purchase it at my local nail supply store. Well, it's not my local nail supply store. It is in downtown LA, and um, yeah, that's where I get mine. So here I'm just adding my base coat. She's not getting a color on her nails, guys. So I'm just gonna add a base coat and then I'm gonna add the top coat. So basically that's all we're doing here. We're adding our base coat here. Um, kind of, you know, switching hands or whatnot. And then we're gonna add our top coat. We are using the top coat by iJo Beauty. It is a no cleansing top coat. It is a really good top coat, guys. If you guys are not familiar with, with iJo Beauty, I don't know what you guys are waiting for, guys. They have a lot of good stuff. Um, the way I found out about iJob Beauty is by uh, their dip and dab powders. But um, their other items are so good, guys. Um, like the uh, non cleaning top coat, the matte top coat, the foil gel, the foil transfer um, gel, and then um, the blooming gel. They have a lot of stuff, guys. So check them out. Uh, so here basically we are done now. We're gonna add our cuticle oil just to kind of you know um, uh, Moisten those cuticles so we're not um, Yeah, so this is what I'm gonna be doing just kind of adding our cuticle oil with this little brush Going all over the nails and all that good stuff. So basically this is all I'm gonna be doing for her nails guys I hope you guys did enjoy this video Give me a thumbs up a, a thumbs up guys and if you guys have any other suggestions on other videos Let me know down below I do forget guys when I um you know they guys tell me to do things so just uh, you know remind me here down here please on the comments remind me I do forget and I um you know I'm such a busy mom so either I'm busy on work m my kids um like so much so I hope you guys do like this video I hope you guys enjoyed it I will see you guys in my next video guys I'll see you guys bye